Steve Farhood for the Boxing Channel. It's in Canastota, New York, the annual inductions for the International Boxing Hall of Fame. It's an incredible class this year. Julio Cesar Chavez is going in, Costa Zoo, and Mike Tyson. And just a quick word about Mike Tyson. Some people actually have the audacity to question whether he should have been a first ballot Hall of Famer. That is the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. There's an awful lot of revisionist history going on with Mike Tyson. I hear from people, from fans, even from insiders, that he never realized his potential, that he, he was a flash, that, that he didn't last very long. All of this stuff is nonsense. For people who don't remember, Mike Tyson not only unified the heavyweight championship and in dramatic form, he also became the pound for pound leader in all of boxing when he beat Michael Spinks. The fact that he didn't have a lengthy prime, not a concern for me, he's a short, small heavyweight, they never fight very well in their 30s. But Mike Tyson enlivened boxing, the heavyweight division, unified the division, something that hadn't been done in years. We shouldn't forget all this, and for those who think that he somehow doesn't belong in the Hall of Fame as a first ballot fighter, they're absolutely crazy.